Palawan peacock. This type of bird is endemic in Palawan. These birds are monogamous or one partner in lifetime and are considered endangered because of illegal trading, hunting, and loss of habitat. Their colors are indeed captivating especially when their fan-like tails spread. Historic City of Vigan Established in the 16th century, Vigan is the best preserved example of a planned Spanish colonial town in Asia. Its architecture reflects the coming together of cultural elements from elsewhere in the Philippines, from China, and from Europe, resulting in a culture and townscape that have no parallel anywhere in East and Southeast Asia. Don Sol Sorsogon Don Sol Sorsogon is now synonymous to whale sharks with the municipality playing host to the largest congregation of whale sharks in the world. These gentle giants pass through Don Sol during their migration, but aside from the butandings as locals call them, Don Sol is also home to treasure and white tip sharks, pelagics, and manta rays. The best months for whale shark sightings are between March and May. Rafflesia Rafflesia is a genus of parasitic flowering plants. It contains approximately 28 species, including 4 incompletely characterized species as recognized by William Maher in 1997. All found in Southeast Asia, mainly in Indonesia, Malaysia, Thailand, and the Philippines. Hawksbill Turtle Commonly known as the Pawikan, Hawksbill Turtles play an important role in maintaining the health of coral reefs and seagrass beds. Pawikans have been vital in maintaining the health of the ecosystem for the last 100 million years since Jurassic era. Four of its biggest threats include habitat loss, illegal trading, bycatch, and climate change. Tubataha Reef is one of the sanctuaries of these critically endangered animals. The best thing that we can do to help Pawikans against extinction is to leave their eggs and let them multiply. Chocolate Hills this natural monument consists at least 1,260 hills over an area of more than 50 square kilometers. The Chocolate Hills is the most famous and signature tourist attraction of Bohol. And even the national government of the Philippines chose it as one of its flagship tourist destinations. Tarshir, found in the southeastern part of the archipelago, particularly on the islands of Bohol. Bohol Tarshirs measures 4 to 5 inches and is considered as the world's smallest primate. Its size is no longer than an adult man's hand and weigh only about 113 to 142 grams or 4 to 5 ounces. The primate belongs to the more primitive suborder Prosimi or Prosimian that dates back 45 million years. Visayan Spotted Deer, also known as Philippine Spotted Deer. The Visayan Spotted Deer is a nocturnal animal or active at night and is also considered as one of the endangered species of deers in the country. These deers are located primarily in the rainforests of the Visayan Islands of Panay and Negros. Banawe Rice Terraces Commonly referred by the Filipinos as the Eighth Wonder of the World, the Banawi Rice Terraces are a 2,000-year-old terraces that were carved in the mountains of Ifugao. It is largely believed that the terraces were built largely by hand. Presently, locals still plant rice and vegetables on the terraces. Philippine Pangolin Pangolin is an endemic animal in the country located in the faunal region of Palawan. These scaly animals feed on termites and ants, but due to illegal wildlife trading, heavy hunting and loss of habitat for human consumptions, these beautiful creatures are rapidly diminishing. Mayon Volcano also known as Mount Mayon. Mayon Volcano is an active volcano situated in the province of Albay. 
it is renowned for having an almost perfect cone because of its almost symmetric conical shape. Mount Mayon has been the country's answer to Japan's Mount Fuji, featuring fascinating scenery that attracts tourists around the world. Mactan Shrine The Mactan Shrine located on Mactan Island just off the coast from Cebu City is a must-see for everyone interested in Filipino history. It commemorates the Battle of Mactan that took place in 1521 between the Spanish and the Visayan native people in April 21. And, along with paintings and plaques about that battle, it also contains two other important shrines, the Lapu-Lapu Shrine and the Magellan Shrine. Bahay Kubo the Bahay Kubo is one of the most illustrative and recognized icons of the Philippines. The name of the primitive Nipa hut is actually based on the Spanish phrase Kubo, meaning cube, probably because of its rectangular appearance, and Bahay is the Filipino word for house. By tradition, this type of village dwelling is constructed out of organic materials, a perfect example of a totally green structure, a showcase of extreme simplicity and sustainability that has been around for a very long time. 